Hi guys, I am Tejesh with another video on fun math. Today we will see what is mean by many one mapping or one onto mapping. First, let's see what is many one mapping. Okay, a mapping f of a to b. f a to b is a function or a mapping and it is said to be many one function or many one mapping if two or more elements of set A have same image in B means two or more elements of set A have same images means two elements have same images then such function is called as many one mapping or many one function and it is only possible if it is not one one function now let's see what is verbal description of many one function let f a to b and g x to y be two functions which are represented as follows x1 the image of x1 is y1 and the image of x2 is y2 and the image of both the elements x3 and y3 is the same y3 and similarly the same in the g but in the g the set y have four elements and x1 image is y1 and x2 image is y2 and x3 and x4 have image y3 same image y3 and the y4 is the lone image but here there are just three elements in set b and the four elements in set a map to those three and from this it is clear that both the functions f and g are many one functions because there are two elements x3 and x4 which have the same images y3 thus these are many one functions okay how to check whether a function is many one or not there is a method to do that method to check many one there are same as for one one function because mapping is not one one it is many one means if we check whether a function is one one or not if it is not it is many one function we have seen in last video how to check whether a function is one one or not if you haven't go check it now let's see what is mean by onto function or what is meant by a surjective okay if if the function f of a to b f a to b is such that each element of b is the f image of at least one element in a means the every element in set b should be a image it is expressed as the same f a to b now here in this case the range of function f is the codomain we know what is codomain right here in the function f a to b b is called the codomain and the range of f is means all the images in set b is called as range if you want to show this in another way you can tell that f of a is equal to b means it shows every element in b and method to show on to or surjective method to show whether a function is surjective or not it is simple first find the range of the function range of the function y is equal to f of x and show that range of f of x is equal to codomain of f of x then it means that the function is a surjective and there is a point to consider if range is equal to codomain then f of x is on to any polynomial of odd degree has all real numbers and is on to for f or to or means if we take any function on the graph then the codomain of that function is nothing but all real numbers r so it means that for a polynomial to be an 
onto function it should be function from real numbers to real numbers and all the polynomials of odd degree are onto functions the basic function in odd degree is y is equal to x or y is equal to mx plus c its range is equal to all real numbers means its range is equal to the codomain similarly if we take x cube it is also the range of it is also from negative infinity to infinity or all the real numbers so any polynomial of odd degree has range of all real numbers and it is an onto function now let's see what is meant by into function onto function means it is the surjective but what is into function a function f a to b is said to be an into function if there exists in element b having no pre image in b means there should be some lone elements in b which does not have any pre image or which is not image of any function then such function is called into function in another words f a to b is into function if it is not on the function right you can simply tell if it is not on the function it means that every element in b is not a image means its range is not equal to the codomain into function means its range not equal to the codomain means it is just the other case of range is equal to codomain it is just the possible opposite case so if a function is on to then it is not into if it is not on to function then it is into function okay guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you are not comment down below why you have it if you have any doubts comment down below and i'll answer them in the next video